Are you looking to minimize the waste that your household produces, but you have this like constant craving for popcorn? Let me tell you, my family goes through popcorn like crazy. Hi, I'm Allie, literary sewist. Here in my crafting castle, I create projects inspired by the books I read. Today, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can help save the environment and still get your popcorn snack on with this DIY popcorn popping bag. Stick around for the end and we will up our popcorn game with a scrap busting bowl project too. Materials you will need, two rectangles of 100% cotton fabric, 12 inches wide by 24 inches long, and 100% cotton thread. Right sides together, clip and sew along both long sides and one short side, leaving one end open. While I switch my threads out, let me just tell you why 100% cotton is so important. It is a natural fiber and therefore it won't catch fire in a microwave. Most threads on the market are 100% polyester. Polyester will actually melt in the microwave or when you apply a flame to it. So yeah, you don't wanna catch your microwave on fire. You can use whatever seam allowance you like, but I'm using a one quarter inch allowance myself. This is a great beginner project since you only need a straight stitch. Reach inside and turn it right sides out. Tuck in the raw edges by one half inch, clip, then top stitch closed. Fold the top edge down four inches, then fold the bottom edge over that. They should be overlapping by two inches. Sew the two side seams closed with a top stitch one quarter inch from the edge. Turn your bag right sides out and go make some popcorn. Is your family big on popcorn? What methods do you use to make it at home? Let me know down in the comments. In this case, I'm using one half cup of kernels and two minutes and 30 seconds in the microwave or until the popping slows to about two seconds between each pop. Make sure to pay close attention as you test this. Microwaves can vary in different environments and with different strengths. When it's done, top it with butter, coconut oil, or even just eat them plain. Totally up to you. But wait, didn't I say we were going to up our popcorn game? Okay, I don't really like to share, but I have a family that all loves popcorn. So, Moments by Liz. They have a pattern called Tisket a Tasket Baskets, which is a quick sewing project. Liz has some incredible patterns for you to sew. Lots of great gift giving ideas. You can see the Way of Kings inspired art book I made from her patterns here. This pattern is one of the free patterns Liz has made available to her Facebook group members. I will have links for everything available in the comments for you. Tisket a Tasket is perfect for trinkets and organization of all little things, and of course, individual popcorn bowls. I know this part isn't a full tutorial, but I did want to give you an overview of how quick and easy this project is to do. If you're like me and you love to read and snack at the same time, these are perfect for that. I'd also love you to come join the Literary Sewist Book Club on Facebook. We pick one book to buddy read each month and talk about everything else we're reading in between. So check the comments, I'll have links for you guys. If you're excited to make one of these scrap busting projects and make yourself some healthy popcorn, give this video a thumbs up. 
And if you have any good recipes for popcorn, let me know down in the comments. While you're munching on your healthy popcorn, why don't you pop on over here and catch some more sewing tutorials for your next project. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel for future installments of my bookish sewing goodness. Be sure to ring the bell so you get notified every time there's a new video uploaded. We'll see you next time. Mm -hmm. Nom nom nom.